Sorry about that. <laughs> Hello, chip lovers. Get ready to get your snack on, because today we're talking about Doritos. High five. <laughs> oh. I should probably get a napkin. Doritos are some of the most popular snacks in the entire world, with sales of over $5 billion every year. But they didn't start out looking like this. Let's take a look at all the little ingredients that went into making this delicious chip. This is what they got right with Doritos. Cool Ranch, nacho cheese, eat them all night. We talking Doritos, this is what they got right. According to legend, the idea for Doritos came from a Disneyland trash can. Wow, even trash cans at Disneyland are magical. The story goes that when a sales rep saw the employees of a Mexican restaurant at Disneyland discard all their old tortillas, he suggested that they fry them up instead. You know what they say, one man's trash is another man's multi-billion dollar snack company. Arch West, an exec at Frito-Lay, tried these chips and the Dorito was born. Or was it? Another legend suggests that West got the idea from chips at a San Diego roadside stand. So which story is true? It's a mystery no one knows. Kinda like how no one knows what makes Cool Ranch Doritos so good. My theory? Unicorn kisses. Regardless of their origin, Doritos hit the shelves in 1966 with their first flavor. Toasted corn? Um, Doritos? I hate to break it to you, but that's just plain old corn chips. It'd be like advertising milk-flavored yogurt. Fortunately, the next year, taco-flavored Doritos were introduced and the chips were off to the races. Side note, don't eat Doritos at the races. It'll totally ruin your gloves. <sighs> Soon came flavors like nacho cheese, Cool Ranch, and sour cream and onion. Yup, Doritos used to have a sour cream and onion flavor. They discontinued it in the early 80s, I'm guessing because the recipe was stolen by this man. <laughs> In 1994, Doritos spent $50 million on a research project to make their chips even better. I never realized you were worth so much money. After the project, Doritos became wider, thinner, and most importantly, less pointy. The rounded edges help make them easier to eat, but harder to use for throwing stars. It took some work, but now Doritos are so good, they are totally worth the orange fingers. <laughs> Seriously though, I need to find some napkins. Thanks for watching What They Got Right. What should I talk about next? Let me know below with a comment. Then click up there to subscribe to DreamWorks TV for new videos every single day. Until next time, I'm Ruby J, checking out for lunch. <laughs>